I got a wild idea where I wanted to create drums out of thin air. Now you're probably thinking, what the hell? Well, I'm going to basically, <clears throat> in this video, show you how to create, you know, if you can air drum or whatever. I play drums a little bit, so I'm going to do things like this. Um, you know, I'll be tapping them on the ground, so doing like, right? So there's my kick drum recorded. Then I'll have to do another layer. I obviously can't multi-track this. So then I'll do another layer where I'll listen back to my foot pattern and doing the snare. And then I will obviously have to um, put the cymbals and hi-hats or whatever in by themselves in Pro Tools. I could use some awesome drum samples that I have and trigger them, but I figured what would be a fun idea? Create my own samples out of things in this hotel room. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna make a kick drum. So I actually, and and, and I don't have a microphone or Pro Tools set up, so I, I'm making my, my drum samples from my iPhone, and I will prove it to you because I will show you what I just recorded. Here in my voice notes, I have a kick drum. I will play this for you. Kick drum. I had to do two samples for this. Snare. Whoop. So I hit a bunch of different things. Now you're probably wondering, how, what, what am I doing? So I took my shoe and for the kick drum, found this nice piece of leather that'll create a nice slap, right? And I did this. That's my kick drum. For snare, I'm gonna blend this, that sound with me hitting this chair to give kind of that bonky snare. And then I'm gonna make those samples and, and put them in Pro Tools and EQ them, compress them, see if I can make them even sound anything like a kick drum and a snare. So it's gonna be a test, we're gonna see what we can do. I'll go ahead and air drum out a beat and record that as well and put that in Pro Tools, beat detective it, I'll show you all of that, beat detective it and then trigger the wave patterns with these made up wacky sounds of me hitting a shoe on stuff as my drum samples. So for tracking this stuff, I'm actually gonna use GarageBand on my iPhone. I will then ed edit all the stuff in Pro Tools. Um, so basically I have here in GarageBand the voice recorder, so I'm gonna use that as I tap my feet. So I'm gonna uh, go ahead and plug some headphones in so I have a click in my ear and I'm gonna play along to that. That's how I'm going to keep everything somewhat in time and then I can correct it later. All right, so let's give this a, a shot here. I should have Cece do this, he'd be crazy at it. Okay, so there's, we'll just leave it at, at that as far as the, the tracking parts go. So <clears throat> I have recorded in GarageBand and I have uh, a red knee now from slapping it. But uh, <clears throat> let's see what, what my, um, my drum pattern sounds like, just raw from 
tapping the ground and hitting my leg. We have The actual slap from my leg might be good for the snare too, to blend that. There is my pattern. Now we gotta get into Pro Tools and doctor this baby up and turn this into real drums. Obviously, it, it's, you know, sound of me slapping a leather ottoman with a shoe and then slapping a table and a chair with a shoe, so. They're not even real drums, but for, for that, it's not bad. So now, I've got my uh, kick and snare pattern here, as you can hear. This is, this is, this is uh, basically what I played. All right, that looks good. Analyze. Now we're gonna go ahead and separate that. My computer's running a little slow right now because I'm also exporting something in Premiere Pro. So I'm exporting a vlog at the moment. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and quantize this and I don't have a full keyboard. So again, I can't really hit the, uh, the shortcut keys. So uh, now we are on audio clips. 16th note, all right, and we will go edit smoothing, let's smooth that out, let's see what this sounds like. Cool, that's in time. I'm gonna go ahead and finish beat detecting these drums and then show you what we, what we got. I've gone ahead and finished beat detectiving these drums here, these these more, more so tapping hits. And this is what I've got it to sound like. There's one part here where I had to, uh, you'll hear at the end where I kind of had to do a little sound replacing because my feet got a little funky and I had to uh, edit some stuff in. But basically this is what it sounds like so far. Right there. Okay, now we gotta add some symbols, so I'm gonna go ahead and add those in real quick. Here is my drum pattern with me, my snare drum being, this is literally just without even me, this is literally the slap and me hitting the ground. Okay, so you get the idea there. So now what I gotta do is export my fake samples I made from hitting my shoe on stuff. This might even sound worse, actually. But we'll see. <laughs> so, now we are going to trigger them with my fake drum samples that I created. Command S all the time. Okay, let's go ahead and put the kick in. I'm just going to turn the velocity all the way up on this.
doesn't sound like it's triggering those properly. So what I'm going to do is I'm simply going to just do this and that should fix it. Sounds fake, but whatever for the purpose of what I'm doing. Now with my my shitty drum samples that I created, let's see what we got here. Thanks for watching today's videos guys. Trixie and I say thank you. She wants you to go ahead and click on that like button. It helps my channel, it helps me make more videos. So if you wanna see more content, click the thumbs up, the like button, and be sure to click the subscribe button. Uh, it's right down below me. Talking right now, click that button right there. Trixie says click it or she'll bite you. Just kidding. If you wanna check out more of my vlogs, uh, like yesterday's vlog, go ahead and click right here on me. Be sure to give me a thumbs up and a like my videos. It helps me make more. And be sure to always click that subscribe button if you haven't yet. And you can be updated when I get new videos up. Which is most likely daily. If not, it'll be at least weekly for sure. What do you got to say, Mr. Bubs? <laughs> he's probably like halfway missing because he's got a green harness on. Vlog playlist and you can get a whole screen of all of my daily crap that I do. Whether it's boring or interesting, I don't know. That's up to you to decide. So go check it out. Be sure to always subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And hit the like button, those thumbs up. It really helps me make more videos and continue to run this YouTube channel. So thank you. I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, be sure to check out my Get Me Fitness channel as well. If you're into healthy eating and fitness and all that good stuff, then go ahead and check that out and subscribe to that channel as well. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.